Sanyu Gopalakrishnan, MIIndia.com and Thai Detroit. And I have with me one of the vibrant entrepreneurs of the business community, Tel Ganeshan, serial entrepreneur and president of Thai Detroit. So welcome, Tel. Hello, no, how are you? Good. So another year, another event. So tell us about, first let's talk about last year's Thaicon 2009. Yeah. I mean, as you know, last year we had an awesome conference. I right. mean, uh, we really took uh, Thai Detroit to the next level. Mm -hmm. And um, it's not just about doing the conferences. We got so many people creating new businesses, like mm -hmm. people like yourself, uh, jumping onto entrepreneurship. And so many people got funded. So we, we were really impressed and excited with mm -hmm. the results of the conference. Ultimately, that's what it matters. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so, so, uh, so we are we picked up on the momentum from last year, mm -hmm. and here again we are more energized and trying to um, um, put out another outstanding and awesome conference in 20, 2010. Nice. Now, what is um, Business Karma 3.0? I know it's a little bit intriguing. Mm -hmm. How did the theme evolve, and uh, what is it that you're uh, wanting to say to the world? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, of course, last year, you know, we the economy, you know, with uh, the way it is, uh, sky is falling, doom right. and gloom, mm -hmm. and uh, obviously now the economy is starting to pick up and things mm -hmm. are looking up. Mm -hmm. And what we are trying to do is that we are calling upon all successful entrepreneurs to give back. Yeah. And when we say give back, we are not asking money from them. We are asking them to give back their knowledge, uh, lessons learned to the budding entrepreneurs, so right. that uh, you know we can move the economy forward, especially our uh, region. And that's why we have uh, Business Karma 3.0. Mm -hmm. In simple terms, what goes around comes around. Correct. When you do good things, good right. things come back to you. So right. we want to preach, not preach, we want to inject that kind of thought process mm -hmm. into the minds of the entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. And that's why we coined as Business Karma 3.0 create, connect, mm -hmm. and collaborate. Nice, and that's the reason why Pepsi and, um, you know, and Whole Foods and Hanes are all going, you know, that way. So, Absolutely. So it's, it's nice. We so, are trendsetters, as you uh, know. Yes, uh, yeah, <laughs> positively. Yes. <laughs> so what do you think, I mean, I think today's businesses need more than just a good product in hand. So what do mm. you think are the real challenges facing, as a businessman, as an mm, entrepreneur, mm, mm, mm. what do you think are the real challenges that are being faced in the community, in the business community, or, mm. you know, in, in Detroit? Yeah. All right, Tell. Today's businesses need more, uh, you know, more than a good product in hand. So, mm -hmm. what do you think are the real challenges that are that the businesses are facing today, especially in the Detroit area? Yeah, I think the real problem that is facing is really innovation, and um, and somewhere we lost the innovation streak. Mm -hmm. um, if you really look at look back in Detroit, I mean, we have the M1 Woodward Avenue. Correct. Uh, that is the first road that we ever built Correct. on the face of the planet Earth. <laughs> right. <laughs> and that's what Detroit is all about. And right. then, of course, you know, Henry Ford came and he built the cars and showed to the rest of the world how to build cars and how to drive cars. Right. And that came from Detroit right here where we are speaking right now. Mm -hmm. And over the last 50 years or so, somehow we became complacent. Mm -hmm. Somehow we lost that innovative streak. Mm -hmm. And... What we are trying to do is that rekindle mm -hmm. that fire in us right. and and get back on our feet, mm -hmm. which we used to be. Mm -hmm. And that's what really this conference is all about, is really bringing that entrepreneurial culture and mindset mm -hmm. and reignite right. Detroit and reignite Michigan. That is really what we are trying to do. And that is really what is required in Michigan. And if we do that, this place is a great place. Forget about <laughs> Silicon Valley. Forget about Boston. Okay, that's great. That's that's pretty passionate, you know, coming from you. <laughs> because I live here. So, yes, you do. Now, you who started Kaiba Ventures after um, looking at the sheer in energy and enthusiasm mm, 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 um, mm, at Tycon mm, Midwest mm, 2009. Mm. So, what do we have in store for uh, 2010? Yes, um, obviously, you know, we have you know Gaurav Kishore, one of our um, you know core and part of the uh, the the team, and he identified this as a, an opportunity that we should pursue. And looking coming out of the conference, we felt that there are a lot of incubators mm -hmm. that are out in the region. Mm -hmm. And for example, if you need you know ten out of ten things to be successful, mm -hmm. most of the incubations they offer six, seven, you know, so there's still a gap. Right. And we found through Thai Detroit that gap can be filled, and that is mm -hmm. what I'm trying to do. Mm -hmm. And hopefully, after the conference is over, right. we can put all of our minds and energy into it right. and uh, take it forward. So it's just my way of getting back onto the entrepreneurial game. 
Now, uh, uh, now Tycoon uh, Midwest has always been um, a kind of an attraction factor for um, for budding entrepreneurs mm, mm. Um, to gain something out mm. of it, and for seasoned entrepreneurs mm. to give something. Yes. You know, some kind yes, of like yes, it's yes. like a barter system, give and take type yes, of a deal. Yes. So, uh, tell us um, about um, about the the effectiveness of Tycoon Midwest 2010 for budding entrepreneurs and for all those people who are sitting out there in the corporate world. Mm, mm, mm. um, you know. Uh, you know, waiting to make that decision, yes. thinking that to be a huge risk. So, so tell us something yeah. about it. I mean, as you said, I mean, with the with the you know, I call them W twos. I right. mean, the W twos are in, entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. The biggest challenge that they have is sitting on the fence. Right. Um, you know, should I be in the corporate world, uh, put more hours and get some ten grand more from the company, right. or make little bit of risk, jump over the other side, the entrepreneurial side, and make little bit of risk and get huge reward. Mm -hmm. It's always a challenge, okay. and 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 to make the decision, I think mm -hmm. Tycon will facilitate that discussion. The reason right. I say that is because you come and watch all these entrepreneurs who become mm -hmm. successful, and mm -hmm. then getting an inspiration from them, mm -hmm. looking at them and saying, "Hey, these people were in the same shoes like myself a few right. years ago," Correct. and look at where they have become. Right. And that kind of an inspiration, it's an excellent thing for people who are trying to become an entrepreneur. Oh, and that is what Daikan will offer to them. That's cool. Now, um, there's so many things that's happening with the conference. Mm. And um, so I know I have a lot of subsequent questions that are going yes. to come out. But um, in, in a nutshell, could you tell us what the conference has to offer um, with regard to the keynotes, with regard to BPC, the business plan competition, mm. women's forum, global members, there's so many other themes <laughs> and tracks, and, you may, and you've made it happen. Yes. So, so tell us about, uh, in a nutshell, about uh, the keynotes, about um, some of the keynotes that we have. Yeah, done. I mean, we are bringing the, the powerful uh, keynotes into uh, uh, Tycon Midwest. Mm -hmm. The who is who mm -hmm. is in attendance. Mm -hmm. um, and to give you an example, we have Desh Desh Pandey. Mm -hmm. Desh Deshpande, in my mind, is the true embodiment of Thai. Mm -hmm. And he's the true karmic entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. Him coming and attending the conference is really what the Business Karma is 3.0 is all about. Mm -hmm. and, and, and so you would see him, and obviously he, he has started a company, and he's the chairman of A123 Systems, mm -hmm. and they have started a company in Michigan which is about to create 3,000 jobs mm -hmm. in the next three years. Mm -hmm. uh, what that means is that with innovation, mm -hmm. you can still create jobs even in a troubled economy like Michigan. Mm -hmm. um, and, and, and with that A123 system, it is really a birth of a new industry. Correct. And also the rebirth of the automotive industry. Right. So those two things are happening. Right. And, and you know, he's in the clean tech space. Mm -hmm. And him coming and speaking at the conference will be an awesome thing for people, mm -hmm. especially in Detroit, mm -hmm. to listen to and get inspired wow. and, and, mm -hmm. and, and draw some knowledge out of the session. Right. And then you also have other um, inspiring keynotes, correct? Yeah, like we have P.K. Agarwal, who was the former chief technology officer for the state of uh, California. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, Sean Dupiran, who is the CEO of Sean TV. Mm -hmm. We have Sandy Barua, who was in the former uh, Bush administration uh, in the SBN, former U.S. Uh, Assistant Secretary of Commerce. And he's going to be part of our uh, keynotes. And we have Bill uh, Birdsall, who's a former, who's the chairman and CEO of uh, uh, micro med uh, company out of Arizona. Mm -hmm. He's going to be in attendance and also we have David Egner right. from the New Economy Initiative and uh, so you know there are so many high profile speakers uh, that will be in, in, in attendance and it's a great opportunity for people to get inspired, motivated and um, and go on to start new businesses. That's nice. And then I um, and and um, I know there is one other thing that I wanted to ask you mm. about. And you've always been attending uh, the Tycon um, Silicon yes. Valley um, event yes, which happens yes, every yes, May. Yes, yes. Um, so and I'm sure you have something nice to share about it because I know Thai Detroit um, uh, Thai Detroit really had a place there. You know, in terms of um, its standard, you know, it became a standard business practice or some kind of mm, a, mm, a, mm, a, mm, a, an excellent. Uh, podium uh, for us to exhibit one of our, uh, you know, our website or something. Yes, so, yes. So could you share uh, that success story? Yeah, I mean, obviously, you know, and when we started, um, you know, uh, I mean, obviously this is the third year we are mm -hmm. doing Tycon. Mm -hmm. uh, last year we, you know, obviously we had a great conference, but now uh, when we started looking for scouting for speakers, you know, mm -hmm. two years ago, uh, 
we could not reach out to a lot of people. Mm -hmm. Now we are at a position where more people wanting to speak. Mm -hmm. I'm not trying to brag here. <laughs> we just ran out of slots. People Correct. are saying, can we speak? Can you open a new slot? Can you open a new session? Mm -hmm. We are saying, sorry, we'll look it into 2011 and 12. And, and, and that's the, the growth that this Thai mm -hmm. Detroit has achieved. And that's, this, that's the caliber of speakers that we are drawing. Mm -hmm. and, and that is where we are. And then second thing, most important thing, that we were benchmarking other chapters. We are benchmarking Sorry. other organizations. Mm -hmm. Now many people are reaching out to us and looking at our website. Your website is world-class standards. Mm -hmm. And that really goes to the team that is involved. So I'm very uh, satisfied. I've, I'm fulfilled <laughs> uh, being part of such an inspiring and energizing team. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and not only putting out a website, but putting a world-class website mm -hmm. that people get wowed. And, and that's www.tycornmidwest.org. That is correct. And every, everyone should check it out. Yes. And you will feel it is, it's a tremendous website. And so that's what I'm, I'm really very passionate and energized being part of such a great team, you know. So that, that, that's really uh, what my takeaway is really being part of this great team. That's great. We're going to hear more of Tel Ganeshan, uh, more of his thoughts, more of his ideas, all unwinding on October 28th and 29th. So do not miss. It's going to be October 28th and 29th, Tycon Midwest 2010, Business Karma 3.0, Create, Connect, and Collaborate. We're going to have lots of fun. And before we leave, one last question. Sure. I know we have a whole uh, a beautiful entertainment lined mm, up, mm, too. So mm. could you, uh, could you uh, <laughs> I, and there's no other better person to put it than you. So, so tell us about the entertainment. Yeah, I mean, obviously we believe, I mean, the, the biggest challenge all entrepreneurs have, you know, what I have found is that they all work very, very hard mm -hmm. and get burnt out. Right. But in Thai, we believe, we have a philosophy. <laughs> right. Our philosophy is very simple. When you work hard, you should play hard as well. <laughs> right. <laughs> and we mean it well. And right. that's why we're going to conclude this whole conference with mm -hmm. an awesome electrifying entertainment program. Thanks to you uh, for making that happen. We're going to have an awesome... Uh, fashion show. Mm -hmm. We're going to have an electrifying Bollywood dancers, I believe. Yes. And then we're also <laughs> going to have DJs. So we're going to have people unwind, relax, and, 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 and that's really uh, the, the philosophy of Thai. When you work hard, you should play hard as well. And right. we mean it. And, and check us out. Right. and be part of this <laughs> great entertainment and great conference. Yeah, and it's called October Breeze. So, right. uh, Tycon Midwest 2010, again, October 28th, 29th. Do not miss one fantastic, power-packed two days of um, content-rich conference. You're going to hear from a lot of inspiring keynotes, a lot of subject matter experts coming from various industries. You're going to see seasoned entrepreneurs, budding entrepreneurs, venture capitalists, suppliers, vendors, everybody assembling under one roof and it's going to be one great event. Not to miss again October 28th, 29th, Tycon Midwest 2010. Again, our website is www.tyconmidwest.org. Again, for Thai Detroit and MIIndia.com, this is Anu Gopalakrishnan.